Once again, Stuart Little has managed to evade law enforcement by bribing the judge and threatening his children. He's friends with the head of police and has, on several occasions, committed tax fraud, sexual abuse, and invasion of personal property. He sold drugs not only to adults in desperate need of therapy, but also to teenagers and disabled children. This fucking rat picked mostly black neighborhoods on purpose not only to feed the stereotype, but also to, as he said, eradicate the fucking blacks. And missed unsocial behavior, dishonesty, racism, criminality, and a personality that would only fit the devil himself. This piece of shit hypocrite rat is also the head of the Ku Klux Klan, the official American Nazi party, and he controls several brutal prison gangs that have together taken the lives of several hundreds of unsuspecting and innocent humans. It's not only that he lets people kill for him, but it's also that he's gotten his little rodent piece of shit paws dirty himself. He shot a black man that was trying to protect his family from the racial slurs he used against them. He lured a mother of two into a forest and brutally murdered her after raping her in the most degrading way possible. He cut her open and dug into her flesh while screaming, This stupid cunt isn't going to reject me another time, as wanderers were boarded. But not only that, they could also hear him say, Her pussy could be my new rat hole, while laughing vigorously. And as if all of that wasn't bad enough, this embodiment of evil also drowned a child in a well since he, quote, couldn't listen to his fucking high-pitched voice any longer, so I made him meet his fate. I just can't see how all of this is still overlooked and glossed over by the government, and how this piece of shit is still allowed to walk as if he had never done anything to anyone. I'm literally shaking with anger and I'm about to collapse when I think of all the things this white piece of shit has done. I want to drown him in a bucket full of my own cum while pulling out each and every single one of his rat fucking hairs. I want to crush his little bones and smash every one of his little teeth. One by one. I won't be able to contain my anger if I ever see him just one more fucking time. I will run him over and take a shit on his corpse. I'll gouge his eyes out and piss in the sockets. I'll perform CPR on him so he stays alive for just a little while longer to experience even more pain than this tiny little rat ass has caused. Just his smile on TV is enough to make my blood boil and make my fantasies about cutting him into a thousand tiny pieces that I will scatter across the graves of his loved ones. I will cut off his ears just as he did to that nice old lady across the street because he said, and I quote, this walking skeleton shouldn't be able to hear my exclusive voice. It's a waste of my energy and she should just die so I can distribute more of my offsprings across the world. Just produce more children, you piece of shit rat. I will find every single one of them and strangle them with my bare hands. You've done enough to this world. I just want you and everyone that is just related to you in the slightest dead. And the only rest of energy in this world is your miserable life. I will find you and I will end the sorry little piece of shit. You all your life. Smile on my face one more time. I will snap your neck in front of your children. Just like you did with my son that me and my wife tried to conceive for several years. Just because I'm almost impotent and it's almost impossible and we're very lucky that it even worked but you just waste a fucking matter ended his life and told me it was only a matter of time you ruined my life and i'll fucking end yours no one can help you anymore your days are over fuck you Stuart little i will be visiting your grave every day so i can spit on it and pour my dog's vomit over the flowers your family placed i'm gonna make their lives hell after your death with every little detail i can ruin about the days i will piss in the apple juice i will throw my litter in your yard i want to pop your tires and throw dog shit at your front door you'll be sorry for everything you ever did to anyone i'm gonna make you regret everything especially that one time when you thought it'd be funny to throw shit at my wife because it became permanently brain damaged because of it no no i don't know how you can be worse of a fucking human but wait you're not just a fucking mouse in a human clothing i i bet you did you get special fitted clothes because you're such a tiny little piece of shit your your dick isn't even three inches at least make an excuse for it it's not possible for anyone to be such a pile of trash you, you must have mental issues i hope you die a gruesome death i hope you get run over by your own family please just end yourself i just don't fucking know what to do someone please help me i can't understand 
where he's allowed to live anymore. Please, do something. My life is over. I'm crying. And I don't know how to stop this rat bastard. Is there anyone out there? I really need help. His fucking hands are so tiny. How is he even able to drive a car? Not only able, but how is he allowed to even drive? He's, he's a fucking rat. Why doesn't anyone understand? He ran over my mother. He's just so small. I still don't get it. If anyone reads this, please help me. This mouse has taken everything from me. I don't have anything left. If he's going, I will go. I just need to see him die. It is my last wish. Tell everyone related with me. He is, he is at fault. There is nothing I can do. The government is supporting him. There's three moves about his movies about his life, and he has ruined that of others. Why isn't anyone doing something? Please, humans, it is up to us. It's our last chance to do something against Stuart Little. Please, I'm desperate. Please.